All right. Okay, so we're going to just pack on this black all over the eye. All over the eye, all over the lid, all over. Why? Because why not? That's what I felt. I just really felt why not. So I figured I would pack it on and blend up the color all the way up and out. I need a couple of different brushes for this pigment. I guess it's not exactly adhering to this part of the eye. Hmm. You know, let's try something else. It's still going to be black that way. But, where'd you go? Ah. My old friend, Mac. This is a good black. Let's see if that'll work. as a Because this is a very glittery black, and I want it to be glittery. Oh, yeah. Mac got it. Mac's where it's at. I couldn't... I, mm, why did I even bother pulling off the trusty one? The Trustique is good, but you have to wear glitter glue, and I don't really want to wear glitter glue today. I figured I would just do it as so. So, I'm going to pack it on both eyes, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I smoked it out with the black, and I put a little bit of the white from this palette to blend out the edges of the black, just to keep it soft. So now for the fun part. I put out, pulled out <laughs> these Chaos Cosmetic Lippies. Mm-hmm. That aren't very, I don't know exactly how to say it. They dry down really, 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 really well. So I want to try them on the eye. They're little tiny lippies. They're all neon. I'll give you a little swatch of them. This is the pink. And you'll see them on my eyes because we're going to do all the colors. Orange. Let's pull them out of this little container. Blue. And they're kind of like neon. A little bit. Green. I hope I'm pulling enough out on my hands. Maybe, maybe not. And definitely a lot of purple. Okay. So I put them all on the back of my hand. And I'm going to use a very fine liner brush. And some setting spray just to wet the brush. Get the brush going. And I'm going to reach into the pink, and I'm just going to do, like the mask, just swipe. I don't want to do it any rhyme or reason, some, some, somewhat, and just keep going, even if it's a little sloppy. I think it looked really cute. Just a bunch of splashes or tight eyes of color. There's some splats. Right? So like I said, with no rhyme or reason, just splatting it. Look, and then now I'm gonna put on some liner and lashes. Okay, so I put on the purple as a liner. Didn't quite finish my face yet, so I figured I, since we were going so fast with the black, I mean that was really really quick. We'll put some of this Wet n Wild highlighter purple because I want to keep it in the purple on the inner corner highlight. <clears throat> And then I wanted to try a little technique that I saw on TikTok. I mean, it's it's something that is it's cool, but I don't know exactly if it's going to be for me. Now that purple is very faint, but you can see like a, a holographic kind of reflection from it. So I'm going to try this other one from Ulta. So I want it to be a little bit more beamy since it's very matte. Except for the black. The black is the only thing that's shiny. Yeah, that's a lot better. Do it a little bit more uh, intense. Because this looks just like graffiti to me. Doesn't it look like graffiti to you? And then I figured, of course, keep it, keep it goth. Keep it, you know, really sexy. And I'm going to do black eyeliner. And I'm going to tight line. 
top and bottom lash. So I close my eyes to do that, so it hits the top and the bottom lash at the same time. And then we'll come back around with some blue and purple graphic liner, some bright LA color ones. And I guess I'll do like a partial eye. No, I'll do both. The purple is getting drowned out with the black. I don't know if you can see that, but we're going to go with it. We're going to go all across with the purple in the waterline, give it kind of a, I guess a base, because the blue is way more vivid. It's bright. And it does not move out of the waterline, which is so cool. All right, so not to take away from the eyes, I did a nude lip. I did do a beaming highlight because you know your girl can't go without doing highlight. And I'm using two different highlights. I use the Fenty. I believe this is, I don't, I want to say trophy white, but you know, I can't see squat. I don't even know what it looks like. You know how it tells us to do reverse, but it looks just like trophy white. And I put that as a base and then on top, I put a little my Lily Posh on there just to give it that. Star Wars glow, you know? And let me get real close. And I put on purple lashes. I don't know if, you, if it's translating right on the screen, but they are purple. I can show you a pair that I don't, that I don't have on, right? I found them at the Dollar Tree. And they're dramatic lashes. Oops. And this is the pair that I have on right now. So there's purple and black. I don't know if you see them very well. And they're just a little swoop on them. So they're very natural. They're not very, they say dramatic, but these are pretty natural, just dramatic with the color. And I thought that was really cute to put it with my graffiti <laughs> idea of eyeshadow. So thank you guys so, so much for spending time with me. You know, I appreciate it. I really, really do, especially with being so goofy right now. And if you're new here, hey, I'm your girl Davina, and this is our first video for 13 Days of Halloween. Looks that you can wear to work and not be all, you know, but there are going to be some that I want to do some really gooey and graphic looks. I don't know. I don't know. We don't know what's in store, but we'll figure it out. And if you're not new here, hey, I see you, sis. Y'all be sweet and give that candy, you know, out of your mouth and give it to the baby. Be like, no, baby. I'm getting too big because that's where I felt today. I was like, oh, I have this giant lollipop and it was sent to me by my cousin and I was like, let me give that to the baby. And I gave it to my son because I was like, you know what? I don't need it. I didn't do much exercise in the summer. You know, it's hot. <laughs> so yeah, I'm recording this very early. So if you don't understand that part, but don't worry, your girl's very talkative and I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me a, a like, a subscribe, and a comment, and I will get back to you in the next one. I love you guys so, so much. Bye.